Hi, I'm back at the kibbutz and uh, continue talking about education at the kibbutz. So last chapter was about high school and uh, education doesn't stop there with the kibbutz. There is more. And one other chapter that is in my time was very typical that after high school and before you go to the army, which everybody in Israel has to go, um, you do a service year. What is a service year? It is a year that you give to the community. Doesn't matter what you do. You can work with old people, with kids, which is very common, um, or what I did, which is um, uh, go help to a young kibbutz. I, I helped a young kibbutz at the time. That kibbutz was three years old. Uh, and I worked in agriculture. I did what I know how to do. So this is one thing that is very typical after high school. So you give one year free of charge to the community. The second thing is uh, that the community in the kibbutz is expecting from you to continuously giving more to, this, to the country, to the state. Um, so what can you give more? Very typical was going to the, the best elite uh, army units and becoming officers. And this is something that, again, many of, of the kibbutz kids that um, my age were officers in the best um, units of the army, of the Israeli army. Um, so for me, that was four years in addition to the service year. And um, then the education continue. And it continues because you get, no matter if you decide to stay on the kibbutz or you don't, you get three years bachelor degree from the kibbutz. You can choose to go to whatever university or college or whatever you want. And the kibbutz will pay you um, the cost of three years. So I think that with this, that's, that's uh, I can summarize that the kibbutz, the center of it physically is right over there where um, in the center of the kibbutz uh, is the education. Physically, mentally, everything is about education from the uh, age of zero when you are born until the age of, of you know, after university. Now, just to understand, um, after the army, I was back to the kibbutz one year, a little bit more than a year. I worked here in agriculture, which was very important for me. And then I went to one year to travel around the world. And only at the age of 26, I started university my bachelor degree, 26. So this is how late it becomes when when you do all this. Uh, let me, yeah. So with this, I conclude about education. If you have more questions, send it to me. I will be happy to answer and maybe have another chapter. From here on, I will talk about economy. Bye-bye.